In order to understand what life is like with dementia, PK Bevel says you have to step into the patient's shoes, literally. I wanted for normal people to see what it's like to live with dementia by sort of tricking the brain into thinking it had dementia. So this goes on my dominant hand. The program requires participants suit up in some interesting gear. According to healthcare director KT Matheson, the gloves reduce my fine motor skills. The shoe inserts simulate neuropathy or a prickling sensation in my feet. The glasses can be anything from cataracts to color distortion, depth. Um, perception. And the headphones play white noise because Matheson says certain sounds can be overwhelming for dementia patients. I'm in there for eight minutes. I was given a series of basic tasks to complete an order. My feet are killing me. Once inside the room, I started sweating and I couldn't remember what to do. As soon as you walk in there, your memory just escapes you. For caregivers like Alexandria Loudermilk. Hey, Jojo. Hey. hey, Jojo. The virtual dementia tour changed her entire perspective. I didn't really understand why they thought and felt the way they did um, or why they would get so scared with certain things. Like when a door slams or an ambulance drives by. I can definitely understand why they get aggravated and frustrated. Bevel says the tour makes people more empathetic, which ultimately leads to better care. Brenna McDavid, WYFF News 4 in Greenville.